TikTok is an interesting platform to say the least, because sometimes there's a large mismatch between your followers and your views. And the reason for this is the feed on TikTok isn't determined by who you follow per se. I think it's mostly determined on a discovery. So what did you spend time on? And, we're, and TikTok is just going to feed you what they think you are most interested in. And that doesn't necessarily correlate with the creators that you follow, right? So you'll see that even for creators, when they post the, the views they get, will often not be from their followers. It just might be from a larger audience. So there's like a little bit of uh, mismatch there. Yeah, TikTok, I think there's a lot of different monetizations that are happening. I think they had a partnership with Shopify that happened recently. So we'll see where all of this goes and how this plays out. TikTok creators are right now, we're helping them with some of their brand deals, but beyond that, we're holding off for now. Yeah, you know, on the subject of TikTok, it's just so addictive that I've had to steer clear of it for a while, but then I went on for some reason. I found this guy and I wanna say he's an undergraduate in ancient languages, but he can speak Proto-Indo-European and Latin and Greek, uh, Hittite, Egyptian, like ancient Egyptian. But yeah, monetization for him, you know, he's just either an undergraduate or in grad school, but very young. So he doesn't have the same needs of feeding a family and maintaining a staff, but, you know, definitely has an audience. Oh yeah. And, and what you find with a lot of TikTok creators, not all of them, will they'll try to bring them onto different platforms. A lot of creators, you know, recognize that a lot of the money or stable income is earned through YouTube. So a lot of TikTok creators will try to divert their audience onto YouTube or even Instagram. And then the real estate for LinkedIn bios is obviously very, very important in order to, to do that and, and for the fans to continue to stay engaged. A lot of creators start on TikTok because they can grow a lot faster than on other platforms and then try to move that over to the YouTubes of the world. 